Look what's that! I can see something hiding. That's the number zero behind the tree. Look, it's dancing. The number zero is written as. The number zero denotes no objects. Let us see how. Look at the branch of that tree. There are a few colorful birds sitting on it. Let us count them. One, two, three. There are three birds. One bird flew away. How many birds do we see now? Let us count. One, two. There are two birds. Again, one bird flew away. Now, how many birds do we see? One. Look, that bird too flew away. There are no birds on the tree. We say that there are zero birds on the tree. What is that near the tree? It is an ant hill. I can see six ants on the ant hill. Look, all the ants went inside the ant hill. Do you see any ants now? No, we see no ants on the ant hill. So, we can say that we see zero ants on the ant hill. There are four butterflies on the pink flowers. There are zero butterflies on the yellow flowers. So. What did you learn? Zero means no objects. Let us spell the number zero. Z E R O. You now know what the number zero denotes, but do you know? What is its position? It is written before or after which number? Look at this number strip. The first number written on it is zero. It starts with zero. Zero comes before the number one. When we write numbers from zero to nine, we write zero. First, 